in this video i'm going to teach you how to market yourself market yourself because there is something special god will put in you that your neighbor by your side never discovered yet your neighbor by your side have not discovered that in yet so it takes the power of marketing for people around you to know who you are for people around you to know what god put inside you because if you refuse to market yourself you you may not be able to be known to people that need you i discovered that god created man and put something inside each and every man special and different that in one area you need me in another area i need you and god made us that our life is like a business our life is a business because when i am in need of who you are and what you have i will come to you and when you are in need of who i am and what i have you will come to me but you discover sometimes you look at yourself you think there is nothing inside you in this video you will learn how to market yourself or you discover there is something you have already but you you, you are shy you don't know how to make it to work that is why this video is coming to you please subscribe to my youtube channel and follow me on my facebook page do me a favor by sharing this message to many of your contacts let's join hands together to save life god bless you the power of marketing do you know that marketing is very very powerful the bible makes us to understand that jesus entered into the temple and he carried the book the scroll that is the isaiah chapter 61 the bible says that he carried it in the book of luke gospel chapter 4 verse 18 when he entered to the temple he carried that book the bible and read from it and the spirit of the lord god is upon me because god has anointed me to preach good tidings to the poor god has anointed me to heal the brokenhearted god has anointed me to heal the sick so those people that we are in that situation those people that we are that we are in need of who jesus was or what he carried or the the potential god deposit in him the bible said that after that the eyes of them we are fasting on him they all of them we are looking on jesus in order to receive based on what jesus said who he was based on what jesus said he possessed that is marketing that is the power of marketing that is the power of marketing market yourself you have something inside you make everybody to know it market yourself is not a sin it's not a pride to market yourself, to market who you are, to make somebody to know who you are is very, very important. It's not a pride. There is something inside you. Somebody needs who you are. Somebody is in trouble right now and who you are, who God made you to be and the gift God deposit inside you is the solution to that individual. And the, when you solve that solution, you discover that money and material things will come to you god make your life to be a business everything about humanity is business market yourself the bible said that after jesus saying that in the eyes of people people that were sick people that were poor people that were broken people that were in that situation that need who jesus was that needed the gift that jesus carried their eyes were fasting on jesus they were they were hungry to see their solution being their problem being solved they were really eager to receive from what jesus possessed you have something inside you but you discover sometimes they tell you that you don't need to be proud you, you need to be humble god don't like your proud people no it's not a proud people remember that to know a slave is that a slave cannot talk slave cannot express himself the slave cannot be able to make people to discover him a slave cannot make people to know who he was but you are not a slave that is why you need to market yourself you need to market yourself you need to market yourself and make somebody to know who you are make somebody to know who you are if you know how to do this work very well advertise yourself advertise those things you discover that the people that that understand the power of marketing they are busy marketing their product you see them doing advertisement on television you see them doing that advertisement on radio station those people you are cherishing right now they are no better than you sometimes you have more you have something inside you more than what they have you have something inside you more than what they have but they understand the power of marketing they market themselves to you they ended up marketing themselves to you and you you lose your own self 
you now cherish them and follow them more special than who you are. Sometimes you think they are better than you. Do you think that those people that you are cherishing right now, they are better than you? They are not better than you. Somehow you have something inside you more than them, but you don't know the power of marketing. You need to market yourself. You need to market yourself in such a way that everybody will know who you are. Everybody should know who you are so that people that need what you have and need who you are will come to you. Sometimes you think that what you have is very, very little. Sometimes you cherish what another person has. You cherish the gift of God in the life of another person. Because you think that that one you have is not enough. You did not value it and did not cherish it. But let me tell you, what you have right now, in as much as small you think that particular thing may be, is enough for God to use to advertise you. That thing you, dis you have right now, that gift of God inside you, market it. That thing you know how to do, advertise it. That thing you understand well, make people to know who you are. That is the power of marketing. Let me tell you, the world needs you. We are waiting for you. The people of the whole world, the world entirely, is, need, is, is in need of you. They are waiting for you. Until you market yourself to the world, they may not discover who God makes you to be. Your problem cannot conquer you. In the name of Jesus, I pray for you that the Lord will open your eyes more and show you something you don't know yet. May the peace of God and God of peace be with you. Shalom. Peace.